G'day everyone, Grantor here again with a 1v1 tournament battle. This is in the um, Blade Balance tournament. I've just um, substituted in, so this is the first round, first game, and my opponent is a legionary brick, I think it was, yep. He's a good bloke. I um, had a bit of a chat to him. Seems like a very nice fella. Anyway, for my build, I've chosen Galatia, and my build I've got the two mercenary Cappadocians on the left flank, followed up with the uh, Levy Freeman, Galatian Spears, Galatian Swords, two of them, and uh, Celtic Slinger. I've got the upgrades on the Galatian Swords and the Galatian Spears. Then I've got the uh, four Galatian legionaries in the middle. It's uh, max four of the same unit. Uh, max eight melee infantry. So I've got uh, mercenary Syrian archers at the back of them. So on my right flank I've got the Galatian swords again for an upgrade. And Levy Freeman for an upgrade. Celtic slinger out the front. Then I've got the two Galatian raiders with an upgrade. And a noble horse as well for me general. And for Legionary Rick, he's got the uh, Citizen Cav, Tarantine, Militia Hoplites on his right flank, two Mercenary Samnites, no, two Rios Spears. Then he's got the two Pikemen out the back, uh, the three Slingers. And on his left flank, he's got the two Pikemen there again, two Mercenary Samnites backed up. Oh no, that's a Mercenary Samnite and a uh, Mercenary Veteran Hoplite, sorry. And then he's got the Thorax Hoplites and then the Thurial Spears. Hippius Lancer General. And then he's got the uh, Tarantine Cav and the Citizen Cav again. So we'll hit play. So I'm just moving up. Um, Going to get my troops in into this uh, city here. And then I realise that he's got the... Semnite over here. So I'm going to have to bring uh, one of my legionaries over the, to the right flank to, to deal with that because I've only got the, the weaker Galatian swords there. Just trying to bait these cav out in the flank a bit more to get me a Levy Freeman into them. Give me Galatian spear. Galatian spears are a good unit. They've uh, Got 70 melee defense with one upgrade, 26 melee attack, and 26 weapon damage. Base morale is not too bad, 56. So, the good unit in uh, tournament rules battle where you can only bring 8 of the swords. So, I'm just going to try and these Glacian Raiders and my general out in his right flank to deal with the cav as well. He's um, situated in a good spot, got the tree cover, got his slingers out the back. I'm just going to soften up the uh, pikemen a little bit with my uh, Celtic slingers. So we're going to be getting a shot onto them. Just a bit of a side shot. The unshielded side, and that should um, soften them up nicely. And I'm going to do the same with my Syrian archers. Just give these pikemen a few, a few shots. He sees it. He's trying to pull them back here, just out of range. And soon he'll bring up his uh, slingers as well. So over here, I've got the Glacian legionary. I've moved him over, and I'm going to get a uh, good charge in here. On his Samnite Warriors. So get a good charge with my Glacian Swords under the Thurio Spears if I can. Thorax Hoplites here. Got a good charge with my Glacian Swords. So we had one more Mercenary Veteran Hoplite, so I'm going to bring another Glacian Legion out here and just keep two for the other side. Getting a couple of shots off. Over here, I've ran out and grabbed hold of his um, 
Citizen Cav, my Glacian Raiders, get the Levy Freeman in to help. Glacian Raiders take the brunt, and then my General comes in for the Hippias Lancer General. I've ended up catching uh, mercenary veterans for my Glacian Legionaries, and now I'm going to be able to get some good flanking shots off here onto the mercenary veterans with my slingers. Some great side shots, which are going to hurt them bad. So he just starts trying to pull away the citizen cav. I'm just going to chase my levy freeman, chase them off. Going to run out and grab the Tarantines with what's left of the um, Glacian Raiders. So some good side shots in here, which is going to help this uh, engagement here very much. And uh, turn it into the favour my Glacian legionaries. As you can see the shots coming in gonna devastate them. There's a few more shots coming in there. General on general, I've done enough damage, looks like my general's gonna take that fight. Over on the left flank it's just a bit of a star mate. I've just been uh, getting rid of his skirmish with my skirmish. Brought another Glacian legionary over. Now I'm going to move over here and sandwich these um, pikemen. I'll hit them front on because I've got me Glacian swords in the back so that will hold them still. Well, the Glacian swords in the back do the damage. I'm going to turn back around and uh, do a bit of a derpy kind of charge here over into the Thuros spears so they can't shoot anymore. Thuros spears should get hammered on my Glacian legionaries while these Glacian swords are getting into the back of the pikes. He hasn't turned around yet, so and uh, going to devastate him. So the engagement's happened over here. Glacian legionaries and mercenary Samnites. The archers are getting some good flanking shots. Over here, I'm going to get a good charge off with my Glacian swords into the Samnites. Glacian spears into the militia hoplites. And over here, I've got me uh, Levy Freeman. The merc and mercenary cappers into the citizen cav. I'm just going to try and shoot the um, Tarantine, but they're going to come in for a good charge. So that's all wrapped up. The right flank is mine. So I was out of MA with my Syrian archer, so I just thought I'd run them in and lock up the pike so I can get a good recharge in. And uh, same over here, Syrian archers were out of ammo, so charged them in. Threw our spears, dying to the Glacian swords pretty rapidly. There's not going to be uh, much of a competition there. And these Tarantines are going to come in for rear charges, but I'm um, going to hit a rear charge of my own. Be mercenary cappers, which is going to devastate the um, mercenary Samnite warriors. Put the herd on them. The um, Glacian spears have done well over here. They've uh, held their own. And it's all but over at this stage. It's getting a few real rear charges in. Seen his pikes was facing the wrong way, so get a rear charge in with my general. The mercenary Sam Knights are all on their own on this flank by the looks of it. So, same with them once they got uh, swamped and routed. And that'll be game over. Good game to uh, Legatus Rick. Sorry, I was calling him Legionary Rick, I think. So, Legatus Rick, uh, good game, mate. And hope to see him in more tournaments. It was his first tournament, so 
and uh, he's usually playing a bit more Attila than Rome so hopefully he gets uh, a few more tournament games in I just had the um, better build at this stage so we'll see what kills what got what my general got 110 kills and not many losses my 2k have done well not too many kills Glacian Spears 90 which is good 133 for one of my Glacian Swords 143 and 141 for two of my Syrian Archers which uh, have done very well and then we've got um, Legionaries done the job solid unit 180 for Glacian Swords which is unreal and my two Glacian Raiders I just used to uh, grab hold of his cav so I could get the Spears in there and for Rick He's got the Tarantine Cave done alright. His general got swamped by the uh, my general and a spear. Some knights didn't perform that well. His veteran hoplites uh, got hammered on the side by the slingers. And uh, yeah, so that was a good game. Well played, Rick. And um, I advanced to the next round two of the Blade Balance tournament. So what uh, Blade's done with these trips yeah, seems pretty good so far. I haven't really gone in depth with the uh, Blade da Balance uh, trips yet. This is my first game with the Blade Balance, but so far it seems good. So well done to Blade. He's done a good job here. And I'll see you in the next game. Thanks for watching.